On our big panel this evening, can Shinde avoid a comment on this? With me in the studio is uh, Minhas Merchant, well-known columnist. Thank you very much. Also, Bharat Kumar Raut of the Shiv Sena joining us here. Sanjay Nirupam for staying back. Mahesh Jetmalani, senior advocate and leader who's been estranged from his own party of late. I don't know if he's making an official comeback soon. Thank you, Mahesh Jetmalani. Vinod Mehta, editorial chairman of Outlook. Naresh Gujral of the Shiromani Akali Dal. Hartosh Singh Bal, political editor of The Open Magazine. Sankarshan Thakur of The Telegraph and John Dayal, Secretary General of the All India Christ, uh, Christian Council. Thank you very much, gentlemen, for joining us on this debate. May I begin by asking uh, Mahesh Jetmalani. Mr. Jetmalani, first of all, it's nice to see you. I thought, you know, if Mr. Gadkari had been on, we would have liked to comment on your relationship with Mr. Gadkari and how that's fathoming out, but that's no longer relevant. Tell me, Mr. J Mahesh Jetmalani. I assure you. <laughs> I'm sure of that. Uh, Tell me, Mr. Mr. Jet Malani, besides this outrage about the use of a color for terror, is Mr. Shinde completely wrong? Because he might be talking not about uh, a religion, but about the organizational links of the accused. You know what I'm talking about. So why muddy waters? by making saffron appear to be about religion. I, he has not talked about organizational links. He's talked about terror training camps. He's, he's, step, he's gone overboard and if you ask me, it's a slur campaign on his part and it's a slur campaign to divert attention against a pet, pending petition in the Bombay High Court challenging the legality and constitutionality of the National Investigating Agency, a federal agency encroaching upon crimes committed in the state in which one no, no, of the no, no, grounds Mr. Jait Malani, Mr. Jait Malani, I'm, I'm answering your question. He's not talking about Hindu uh, terror. He's uh, talking about saffron, ter saffron terrorism. And my question to you, saffron terrorism may be a reference to the organizational links of the what accused. What do you mean? Because of, be I mean, I mean, no, whatever they are, no. they are accused of. What are their links with, with, uh, with, with the RSS? There have been links with the RSS in the past. Well, from the Samjhota to the Molega blast. Well, either to, then. To Mecca Masjid, those are all pet Ajmer Sharif, which is exactly what I'm telling you, Arnav. Arnav, Arnav. Uh, you know, you can go on, you uh, add nauseam, but let me tell you, as far as most of these cases are concerned, there's a pending petition saying that the NIA is no, no. So don't. So this outrage will not work. Not you, are, you can see the outrage is unjustified. You know, we are outraged. We will hit the streets. This is an affront on a religion. It may be a convenient are, first no, day. First show by Rajnath Singh, but beyond the first day, first show by Rajnath Singh, wha where does it stand? My question goes to Sankarshan Thakur first. Yeah, uh, Sankarshan, uh, uh, do you agree with, with, the, uh, with the political first day, first show of Rajnath Singh? Listen, Arnab, you know, you know theoretically, um, uh, uh, terrorism being attached to a religion or a color, I, I think, is wrong. Theoretically, I believe that. But when that idea is thrown into the crucible of reality and linkages are found, then names have to be named. And, and I don't know what, what facts there are with Mr. Shinde because he has not bothered to um, sort of enlighten us on those facts. But if there are facts and there are established, uh, established linkages, uh, names have to be named. Uh, I, I, saffron, the color, why should it be the copyright of one party? It's a color on the national flag. Hindus are not the preserve of one political party, for God's sake, in this country. Otherwise, this country would have been governed by, by, by people you and I know a long time ago. But if these linkages are found, then uh, investigating agencies must investigate and prosecution must follow, as is, is happening in some no, no, cases. No, no, but why is the Home Minister of India... You named, no, no, but why is the Home Minister of India drawing an imagery? There is a religious imagery, Sankarshan Thakur. Why are you in denial? The Home Minister of oh, India is a, is a policy. Why are you in denial? There is, there is, the, if everyone agrees terrorism is terrorism, I, I saying, if everyone I agrees am, terrorism has no religion, why mention I any color? Say, why did the Home Minister of India not say violent I terrorism? I began by saying... <coughs> Blue terrorism. I began by saying, Arnab, that 
that theoretically I do not agree with these formulations. But it's a political at all. Problem. As I said, saffron is the color on our national flag, for God's sake. No, you are digressing from the attempt to draw religious imagery. Sankar Shantag, you're not, you're not coming to terms. So, so is Green. One minute. So, I am not a spokesman so, for the so Congress is Green, party. But you don't call Jai. Why are you treating you, me like yes, a spokesman? Yes, Mr. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. The party. Sorry, yes. sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> yes, Mr. Jet Palani. Sorry. No, no, no. But so, but so is Green a, a part of the flag. But Mr. Mr. Uh, Shinde hasn't called Jihadi terrorism Green terrorism. Precisely. Fair enough. So I'm when he has. That issue. So when. So when. when so then, so so when he when he hasn't, when he when he hasn't when he's not talking yes. about the Simi or the Indian Mujahideen as green terrorism, then why is he talking about saffron terrorism? Exactly. When it Adam, comes to these people, I mean, Adam, that's what Sankar 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 Sankar. Why are we? Can't, can't, I, you know, I'm not from the Congress, Mr. Jeshmalani, but, but, but can't you see how embarrassed the Congress is about that use? No, embarrassment, I don't see. No, but, they, they, we're getting counter reaction. No, I can't. I, no, I, I, no I, I, can't, I can't. I can't. I honestly can't. I think it's a political move and I think that the Congress, Digvijay Singh, has supported him. Many people have come out in favor of his statement. That's regrettable. But the best thing to do is to avoid it. The you BJP the too and the Shiv Sena too. One minute. Bharat Kumar, now the BJP and the Shiv Sena too can avoid it. But it seems to me that the BJP is going hook, line and sinker for it instead of ignoring a comment that the Congress party and the government is itself embarrassed about. Yeah, Arnab, that, no, no. Why, why, is, why, why is the BJP latching on to it? Almost as if it is a political lifeline. Why? Arnab, Arnab let, let, let me explain the whole thing to you. See, terror is a terror. Sorry, is a terror. Uh, it, it, has, it has no religion, it has no color. All no. agree on this, this point. Having said that, if the, the Home Minister of the Nation if he makes a point blank comment about one color terrorism that is saffron terrorism, then do you think this type of cost toxic comment, caustic comment should go uh, unchallenged? No, but, why is but, the BJP going, going to town over it? Of course, then who will go to town? Who will go to town? No, the, the BJP the says we are going to lead protests 11 o'clock tomorrow Soka, morning, Soka. Sushma Swaraj leads protests on this Of subject. course, of course, this has to be challenged. This has to be challenged right there. Is it being challenged or is it being inflated and politically hyped deliberately no, it, by no, the BJP it, it, because it, it, the BJP it, it, feels it, it, see, because the BJP feels that I want to get in with BJP uh, ally right uh, now. Uh, uh, Arnab, let, 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 let me complete my, my uh, comment on this. The thing is that Union Home Minister has made a comment. If he says it is it is saffron terrorism by by RSS and uh, 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 BJP. He is the Home Minister. BJP. He has National Investigation Agency, he has ATS, he has CBI, all the agencies under his control. If he has so many proofs, then it was his duty. Before making a public comment, he should have asked the agencies to investigate and if, if, he, found, if he found proof, then he should have gone to the court or he should have gone to the police and done that. Why should he make a public statement on the forum no, no, but of I, his own party? Well, I, I, and you, you say that we should, we should uh, ignore it. How can you ignore it? He is not Tom Dick and Harry. He is the Home Minister. And anybody... So what do you, what do you want in, him to do? It has, it has brought shame to all those who are concerned about issues like terrorism. We can't take terrorism lightly as perhaps the Home Minister and the Congress Party and some other people here. Well, it appears, it. To me, it appears to me, Mr. Mr. Bharat Kumar Raut, that the BJP, Shiv Sena and parties close to it, I don't know if the Shiromani Akali Dal will try to milk this issue politically. Where is the question of milking well, this as issue? Mu as much as, as, much as the where? people, as much as those who spoke about the phrase Arna, saffron where terror, is, where I'm, is, I'm getting where into the question of uh, milking it. If, if, if at all it was, it was a union home minister no, no, who is milking the issue. What is what? For no reason. Is there no other issue that tomorrow the BJP has decided to carry out, you know, begin a series of nationwide protests on this very issue? Yes, should be. Another, I'm saying BJP is late. It should have started that day. It should have started that day. Vinod that Mehta, moment. Vinod Mehta, you know, why, why is this, this, this particular statement of the Home Minister, why is it not being immediately neutralized by the Congress Party? If the Congress Party wants, it can come and well, say, we don't believe in what the Home Minister exactly. said. He has said something wrong. Yeah. And the Home Minister can come and say, I said something wrong. Why is he not doing that? Arnab, I think we should be quite categorical here and say that Mr. Shinde's remark was regrettable. It should not have been made. Saffron terror, Hindu terror are terms we don't want to use. And the Congress is in some damage limitation mode. But I have no hesitation in saying that it was an unfortunate and regrettable remark. 
You see, Adnab, if we get into a situation where we talk of Hindu terror on one side and Muslim terror on the other side, and one party is supposed to support Hindu terror, the other party is supposed to support Muslim terror, we are getting into extremely dangerous territory. I agree with you. There is terror. There is terrorism. And I think this has been set point time and time again. I don't know why we get back to this meaningless debate when we all know that there is terrorism. So what, but no, if the party it, political do you, do you, divide says this is your terrorism and this is my terrorism, <laughs> then we are in very dangerous waters. Having said that, I think the 10 people who have been named by Mr. Shinde and who at some point, if not now, were involved with the RSS, well, that's a tricky one for the RSS. I think they would need to explain when and when they disassociated themselves. But Hindu terror, Muslim that's terror, what... Saffron terror, I categorically criticize and condemn these terms. Precisely. And that's where Mahesh Jetmalani, you are on the back foot. You can talk about Swami Asimanan. You cannot, you know, you, uh, they, so he was associated with the RSS wing, the Vanvasi Kalyan Ashram from the 1990s to 2007. So you cannot, you cannot have this. Well, you know something. No, no, no one second, one second, one, 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 one second. So one minute, Mahesh Jatmalani, no, 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 Mahesh no, Jatmalani, no, 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 it has been no, said no, by no, our panelists that, it has been said by our panelists that the Home Minister has breached the limit. No, 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 you're being tendentious. I am not. You're being a, I am saying. You're being tendentious over here. You are being tendentious over here. Mr. Nobody Jetmalani. Nobody the back foot. The matter is pending in court. There is not one convicted, there is not one person convicted of what is called saffron terror. And the Home Minister is trying to subvert the course of justice by using the influence of his office to influence pending litigation. That is regrettable. What I have said very clearly, Mr. Jetmalani, which you chose not to listen to, is that the Home Minister has clearly breached the limits. By making this comparison about a political party running terror groups. You chose not to listen to that in your rhetorical flow. Saying that I am being tendentious. I want to go across. I'll come back to you. Naresh Gujral. Naresh Gujral. Uh, would, no. do, do, why do you feel the BJP is latching on to this? Why do you think Rajnath Singh is determined to make a massive political issue of this by hitting the streets tomorrow? Uh, first of all. I think this is being done more by the Congress. We have been victims of this in the past. You would remember in the 80s, they dubbed every Sikh as a terrorist. And they talk, then talked of Sikh terrorism. Today they are talking of saffron terrorism. They are the ones who play politics. They are the ones who divide the nation. And they talk, call themselves secular. I mean, this is shameful. I think what the Home Minister has said today is highly irresponsible and he must apologize and if the new BJP president is taking him head on, I commend him. After all, he must defend the Sangh Parivar, especially when they have not come out with any evidence. Hartosh Singh Bal, should the Home Minister stop avoiding the cameras now? Arnab, I think there's a lot of hypocrisy involved in this debate. In November this last year, November 9th, if I may be precise, I think your channel ran a program which said the return of Sikh terror. It was a two-part exclusive. Uh, the term Sikh terror, Islamic terror has been used in this country for 25 years. Nobody understands it to mean that all Sikhs are terrorists or all Muslims are terrorists. It indicates that the religious ideology of those terrorists owes something to their perceived vision of a particular faith. And in exactly those terms, the term Hindu terror should apply here if we have been using earlier terms in those cases because these 10 people have their affiliations in a particular kind of perverted ideology which they claim draws its roots from Hinduism. If you want, call it Hindutva terror. But suddenly that this country should wake up and all be affronted by the term Hindu terror while it has been conveniently using the term Sikh and Islamic terror is all sorts of nonsense. And your own channel has done No, this. no, one Everybody second. What Arthur Singh Bal, let me, let, other, me, let me make the point very terms. clearly to you and an unambiguously. Our reports there were about Khalistani yes. groups trying to use... Exactly. So your the point term? is correct to a limited Arnav, extent. You can go back and check. No, no, no I go back and check. The, the point here is no, no. One clear point. There is no please religious. Check, please the, check. What are I'm you justifying? No, no. There Hartosh, is a certain hypocrisy involved Hartosh, in this debate. Hartosh, are you justifying the use of a religious prefix I'm to not. terror? 
then why do you say it's hypocritical? It shouldn't have been done then, but suddenly well, to wake up, established. but yes. I think suddenly to wake up to it now is a political usage. Political usage by whom? Absolutely. By everybody who is getting involved in this debate, there is nothing, there is no big deal. Suddenly today the term Hindu terror has been used when we've been using similar terms in the past. Why are we making it an issue now? No, but the, because the Union Home Minister of India... Exactly. Either, either no, no, because the Union Home Minister of India... He has said Hindu terrorism. No, no, every no, kind no, of no, terror... He has said saffron terrorism. 